Some of our area farmers markets opened over the weekend, including the one out of Village Point. You might enjoy them, but not everyone has access to fresh produce. Those areas are known as food deserts. There's a campaign to give some good. Ellie Krieger is a New York Times bestselling author, host of Healthy Appetite, and a registered dietitian. She joins us today from New York's Grand Central Station, and it sounds busy. Good morning, Ellie. Hi, Mary. Yeah, it's really a troubling issue in this country. 29 million Americans do not have affordable access to healthy food. It's a really big problem, and here I'm teaming up with Outshine Frozen Snacks and Feeding America to really help make a difference in an easy and delicious way, actually. So one of the things is we're here in Grand Central Station, New York City, launching this incredible, innovative, interactive billboard. And what it is, is people come by and they swipe their credit card, and for a donation of $1 on that credit card, um, literally nine pounds of fresh produce is going to be delivered to people in need. And you can kind of see it on the billboard, you can kind of see the graphic yeah. of that person receiving all this wonderful produce. Um, and so it's a terrific program, and it really brings light to the issue of the need in this nation and is making a difference. And if you're, and we're in New York now, we're going to Chicago with the billboard, uh -huh. but if you're not in any of these areas anytime soon, another way you can make a difference is Outshine Simply Yogurt Bars will have specially marked boxes in June and July. And for every box sold, uh, Outshine will donate one pound of produce to, uh, to someone who needs it. And so you can have a delicious, healthy snack Mm -hmm. um, that's 100% yogurt because the uh, Outshine Simply Yogurt bars are the only uh, bars with 100% yogurt. And, uh, and do some good, give some good, as we call the billboard, yeah. uh, at the same time. What causes food deserts? I'm sure there are many factors, but what are some of the most common? <clears throat> Yeah, so essentially it's, uh, it's an indication of, of how far you live and how much access you have to healthy, affordable food. And so depending on where you live, in rural areas it's defined as about 10 miles mm -hmm. from healthy food, and in other areas one mile, so it depends on the area. But in general it's considered that 29 million Americans do not have access a ready access and it becomes a really big issue and a big problem for our nation's well-being because if you as a as a nutritionist as a chef as a mom mm -hmm. if you don't have access to healthy food you can't eat healthy you can't be healthy and ultimately there's a very big cost to that um, so I'm really thrilled to be here with Outshine Frozen Snacks and Feeding America to help make a difference a general question about the benefits of fresh fruits and vegetables, we hear all the time that they're important, but nutritionally speaking, why? Why are, why are we encouraged to get so many servings per day? What's the big picture? You know, people often ask me, what's the single most important thing I can do to change my health? Eating fresh produce is the single most important thing you can do to change your health. And there's so many layers as to why. There's so many nutrients with so few calories in most produce. Um, you get a lot of water and fiber, so you get filled up faster. Um, it also, these products have, um, have antioxidants which protect every cell in your body from pretty much any disease, you name it. So it's just, you can't lose. Plus, from a culinary point of view, this uh, wonderful food is what makes food exciting and colorful and flavorful and also healthy. So it just is, is such a key, critical issue in terms of, uh, of eating well. We'll keep an eye out this June and July, since I think most of us here in Omaha, uh, that'll be the easiest way to give some good. Uh, enjoy New York there, Ellie, and thanks for taking the time to visit with us today. Thanks, Mary. Nice talking with you. Likewise.